everybody, it's Christina, and I have two pocket letters, Christmas pocket letters that I made, and I challenged myself to use as much Tim Holtz products as I could, so I went through my craft room, went through my stash, and pulled just about everything I have of Tim Holtz. So it started out with this paper. This is an old pad that I have. It's called Paper Stash Seasonal. So I used, for the background of both pocket letters, I used all the Christmas papers. And then I used these cute little stickers. They have a whole, uh, like a whole bunch of Christmas words in the back. So I used a little bit of that. Then all these are all the dies that I used. This movers and shapers one is so cute. I think it's called the, yeah the vintage telephone. This tiny little um, and this fits perfect in a pocket letter. This little dress form. These words here. I think I used joy to the world love this one. This one is called, uh, I don't know, but there's the number. Love that one. I just love this the little, um, the berries one. Oh, and this one is so cute. I use this and the coffee cup and the bird cage and the poinsettias. And then I had a bunch of embellishments and I used those too. So let's just get this out of the way, and I'll show you the first pocket letter. There's the birdcage. So I, as I said, all the background paper is from this paper stash here. I um, inked this up and then used some embossing powder on it, added some winter type flowers there, and there's the birdie. And then in here I added some bells and some Christmas charms. And, you know, I had first covered this all up, but this is part of the paper, and I really love, like, this design here with the house and the tree. So I decided not to cover it up and just used um, use some gel pens to color in the tree, peace on earth, and some bling, and a wooden snowflake. And that's the coffee cup die. And this poinsettia is so pretty. I cut it out on the say on the with I use this paper the music sheet paper and see that little um, dress form it fits right in the pocket here love that it says hello gorgeous and that's a stick pin an embellishment from Tim Holtz and so is the wish ticket in the center pocket I put some sequins in there and then use this blessed cutout die and there's my letter pocket and this is a Tim Holtz embellishment. And this is a Tim Holtz embellishment. Um, that is the little, what, when, what is this called? Framelets. It's got to have a name. Well, I don't know, but these kitty cats are adorable. I cut the kitty cat out and little milk bottle. That's part of, part of the set too, that little milk bottle. And I think someone spiked the milk. I made his eyes a little bit weird. They're a little bit green. <laughs> Santa can explain. And then I just added some of these pretty uh, holly leaves and these beautiful berry leaves. And the last one is, oh, look at that deer in the background. This comes out and I left one side open and you can see him in there. Isn't that beautiful? And then I use the stickers that says Reindeer Games. That is the first one, and then this is the second one. And I just love this paper. It's so pretty. It's so vintage. Joy to the world. And I did another one of these. I think someone spiked the milk. But I just use a different kitty cat. And here, that's that typewriter. That's my letter pocket. Shaker pocket. There's the dress form again, and here this is this is um, a frame uh, die that I have that's not a Tim Holtz, um, and there's Santa, but that's uh, from his uh, that's from this paper. And there's Santa. Look at that. He's got he's doing something on the tree, and then here um, this is also a die from Tim Holtz. All the little wonky houses. And then there is the poinsettia again and the coffee cup. 
So it took me a while to finish these, like, I don't know, over a week, but they turned out great. I love them. So I just thought I would share a couple of pocket letters with you. I hope you're all doing well. And we had snow and then it all melted. Now we don't have snow. It's all green outside. But um, I hope it does snow a little bit because I always love snow this time of year. Okay, everybody, I hope you're all doing well and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.